but you guys have put a lot of emphasis on these midweek games. Mm -hmm. How did you feel like the, the mindset mentality was for this one? Well, we came out and got an eight nothing lead, you know, so we scored in what was it, the first two innings and we scored in six of our eight at bats. So I think offensively, even though there were some some empty ones in there too, I mean we drove a lot of walks. We had about six or seven three two wins. Uh, for you know, when we made up for some of the um, maybe some guys left out there by being super competitive at the plate and got some some big hits there along the way. Um, McConaughey set the tone on the mound. I mean, so his first career start for him to come out and do what he did and for us to score early in that game, um, I thought the mindset was awesome. Did he did he do enough tonight to maybe get a look at the Sunday spot somewhere down the line? Absolutely. Yeah, he, he was he was pretty dominant tonight. I mean, he threw strikes and he put guys away when he got to two strikes. So, um, yeah, he looked like a starter to me tonight. It, it, I mean, what's the challenge right now of trying to put together a lineup card offensively? Yeah. Yeah, um, it is. I mean, you saw Sanderson again come off the bench. I mean, he, he got a hit, hit a ball the deepest part of the park, and then there at the end with the bases loaded, hit a ball as hard as you can hit it right at somebody. And, um, again, there's guys that, that didn't get in the game tonight that are that are really good hitters too. So, um, you know, I, I probably, if I had it to do over again today, I probably wouldn't have been as right-handed at the back half of that lineup because I thought it let them kind of settle in at times. But, um, you know, they're – Again, Will Walsh took a great swing with two strikes. Evans took a great two-strike swing. Um, There's some other one. DC had a, a great swing tonight. I thought he put together some pretty good at bats, and, and um, you know, so there was a lot of positives. Is Walsh kind of coming on, maybe forcing more of a straight platoon a little bit there at first. Yeah, I mean, he's got three homers in his first what three games. So um, I'd say, I mean, he's a, he's a big guy. I mean, when you need him in there to drive runs in and, and get extra base hits, and he's done that. With Mason in particular, what's what's his last month been like as you guys have been kind of figuring out pitching roles and things like that? Has he come along or has it been a product of, of having an opportunity? Yeah, what I've seen from Mason is in the fall, the stuff was the same, but the belief in his stuff at this level wasn't quite there yet. Um, and he came back, and him and I had a conversation. I know Coach Childers has as well. Uh, this spring, I said, man, I can really tell a difference in your in your mound presence this spring. And he goes, Coach, that's the only thing I've been focused on is just is just my mound presence and attack on the mound. And I mean, he's a big, imposing, physical guy. And so, like when he's got his shoulders back and he's working fast, it, it suffocates the hitter. And uh, that's what I'm seeing from him. And that that's been the biggest change from the fall, where you know he wasn't quite sure, and then now coming back this spring, he's like, okay, I, I know I belong. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna act like I belong. That's been the biggest change for me.